Welcome back everyone. Uh, let's go ahead and do a speed comparison between iOS 14.8 and iOS 15 on the iPhone 7 Plus. Now 14 is on the left, iOS 15 is on the right. So let's get started. All the apps are cleared out. Let's get into it. Let's go ahead and do phone calls. 3, 2, 1. And roughly about the same. Not a big difference there. Music, 3, 2, 1. And I think 15 looked to be a little bit faster here. We did get into a random pop-up here, so I don't know what to make of that one. Let's go and get into something like photos, 3, 2, 1. Is that three, two, one? There we go. And I think working a little bit faster there. Go to the app store, three, two, one. And you can see this one a little bit slower. There's a little bit of noise in the background, so you're just gonna have to avoid that. Scrolling through, you can see pretty much the same exact thing. Uh, nothing super crazy with the loading speeds, as far as I can tell. That's typically what I see every time. Hopping out of this one, let's go and get into news, three, two, one. And we did mess up here, so we're going to hop out of this one. And we'll just kind of see, we'll just kind of load that one up in the background. And we do have a, some of these similar apps between them. So let's get into something like Fruit Ninja, three, two, one. And it does look like 15 may be the faster one here, but I guess we'll see in a second. And 15 did seem to be fast, but this one also had a little bit of a different pop-up here too. So that was a little bit different. So Temple Run 2, 3, 2, 1. And we do have that app tracking, a little pop-up that happened here. And I guess we have to put in our thing here, so we'll just hop out of this one. That was a kind of a lemon. You can do the camera, three, two, one. And again, roughly around the same thing, not a big difference. Clock, three, two, one. Let's get into files, three, two, one. And a little bit of a difference between both as well. Hopping out of this one, we can go and end it off with something like health. You know, that seems a pretty good app to end off with, three, two, one. And there we go, a little bit of difference to be honest. I cannot tell that big of a difference between either one of these. You know, I feel like they both were roughly around the same. They both were fairly fast. I really don't think there was one that was way faster than the other one. So I think ultimately that pretty much covers it up. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section as well. Like I mentioned, full speed comparison probably coming out next week once iOS 15 comes out. But I guess we'll deal with that when that happens. If you guys have any other questions, let me know in the comment section as well. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.